In every vacuum leak detection measurement, there is natural background from the tracer gas in the ambient air. This background drops during the leak detection process. The longer you pump, the smaller this natural background will get and the smaller the slope will become. Let's assume our test object inside the vacuum chamber has a rather big leak. After applying tracer gas to the test object, the red curve will be shown instead of the blue curve. In order to only see the red curve of the leak and not the blue curve of the natural background, we press zero before applying tracer gas to the test object. With the conventional zero functions available on the industry, only the signal above the black zero line can be shown on the leak detector as leak rate. Then, it will look like this. But we know that the real leak size is bigger than that. The real leak size is the difference between the blue curve and the red curve. The new Inficon EcoBoost is able to predict the natural background. All it needs to work correctly are two seconds of the decreasing blue curve before pressing EcoBoost. As a result, the new EcoBoost will show the true leak size instead of an unknown fraction of it. This was in case of a rather big leak. Now we take a look at the situation in case of a rather small leak. After applying tracer gas to the test object, again the red curve will be shown instead of the blue curve. Similar to the case of the big leak, we press zero before we apply tracer gas to the test object. The problem that we are facing now is that the red curve will always be below the black zero line, even if we adjust the zero line to the actual leak rate that we are measuring now. Therefore, a conventional zero function will not show any signal if the red curve is not increasing. But also, we know that our true leak signal is the difference between the blue curve and the red curve. Again, the new EcoBoost is able to predict the blue curve and display the true leak size, instead of pretending that there is no leak at all. All it needs to work correctly are two seconds of the decreasing blue curve. With a conventional zero function, you always need to wait a long time until the blue curve is stable enough to see small leaks. With the new Inficon EcoBoost, you can see small leaks earlier and bigger leaks at their full size. In the end, the leak detection process will be much faster and more reliable with the new Inficon EcoBoost.